my channel my name is Skylar if you are new here I am feeling sick and under the weather as you guys can <coughs> as you guys can hear um but today is Monday and it's been about maybe now we're on the third day of me taking a break from vlogmas um I was doing vlog daily vlogmas since of course day one till day seven um and it is monday so, right did i did i do that math right seven eight nine ten eleven oh no 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 i took four days <coughs> off of doing vlogmas um i was feeling let me go turn off the tv real quick Hold on. i lowered down the tv hopefully you guys can't hear it but i had took four days off um because from recording because y'all my routine was so off um today is like one of the first days that i feel like back to normal like besides me feeling the way i am i my the house is clean the like i just feel better i went to go exercise i had breakfast like i just I just needed that reset type of thing and I knew that I couldn't continue doing vlogmas every day because I hadn't prepared myself, I hadn't set myself up um, basically like for success for the rest of the month um, because I know people had pre-recorded videos and things like that, I did not. But anywho, that's the tea on vlogmas but I did promise you guys that I was going to do weekly vlogmas so what a better day to start weekly vlogmas than on a Monday. I am so sorry um, if I sound like shit. <laughs> I don't, <clears throat> I don't feel as bad as I sound, um, if that counts as anything. But yeah, I wanted to open today's vlog with you guys, or this weekly vlog with you guys. Today is Monday, and I woke up around seven. Um, my man and I had some pancakes. Um, I cleaned up the house, I swept, I just need to mop, like that's what I've been lacking on is, um, slacking on is the mopping, I can do long, all laundry, I did dishes, I cleaned up the kitchen, the bedroom, the bed, like I can do all of those things, but when it comes to mopping, I guess because <clears throat> I'm not used to the mop that we have, it's called the Libman, Libman, well, what? And I used to use the old cedar mop, but I do like this one, I just think I need to get used to it um and like get the method of it you know what I mean but anyways I also went um on a walk with Coda I went to go work out for maybe like 30 minutes because my chest was hurting a whole lot maybe a little less than 30 minutes my chest was hurting a lot um I have dry cough so like it hurts um whenever I was like doing my jumpy jacks or doing my squats like it just really 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 was in pain so i just decided to cut it short um <clears throat> i hadn't been feeling the best about my body so i took some before before pictures just so i can um like that let that be motivation for me going to the gym i love the gym guys like i really really do love the gym i i like love working out um i guess the hard part <clears throat> for me is i guess like being consistent um or getting myself in there because like there was a point there was a lot of points in my life basically where i was going to the gym consistently and my body looked amazing and i felt amazing and the gym like wouldn't stop me from like living my day-to-day -day life it was just a part of like stopping what i'm doing because like my adhd can get the best of me my undiagnosed adhd can get the best of me where like i want to clean the whole house i want to do this i want to do that i'll find something else to do um but to tell myself like hey stop go shower change um and go to the gym like <clears throat> i've tried to not shower either I, sh I shower at night right and then i go to sleep and then i clean the house and then I try to like just change it to my gym clothes and go to the gym. But I just feel so nasty. So I have to shower before I go to the gym. So it's like a whole routine to get to the gym, you know. Um, so that's the hard part is like just getting myself there. But I'm really working on it. I take pre-workout. Well, the one I showed y'all in the previous videos. But if y'all haven't seen those videos, it's like a post, like a pre-workout. Um, 
post-workout and like a during workout i don't know what y'all call it but it's called by it's by extend and it makes me feel really good it like um pumps me up but i want to take oxy oxy shred i never tried oxy shred um if y'all have tried oxy shred definitely definitely let me know if y'all like it and <clears throat> what flavor y'all recommend in the comments because i want to get like i think it's called the kiwi strawberry and it's basically like a I think it, they call it like a thermal burner, a uh, fat burner, and I feel like I need a little bit of that, you know what I mean? But anyways, that's enough of me rambling. Today, um, my men and I are waiting for some bedside tables. If y'all have been following me for a long time, y'all know that I recently just moved into my first apartment, and we have been getting things slowly but surely, so um, we've been needing some nightstands, like bad. Like I am a homebody, right? Um, I love getting in bed super early. Um, I love reading whenever like I have the tools to read. Does that make sense? Like if I have like a nightstand, I can put my book there, put my tea there, put my glasses, my little um, night light or whatever, so I can read comfortably. Like babes, I'm gonna read. Um, I always use my iPad or my laptop while I'm in bed and well it's not having a proper nightstand has just been like like I don't even want to be in bed I'm gonna go to bed whenever like I'm knocked out on the couch basically but I just really want a nice nightstand and we found some we spent like two hours no joke looking for some nice nice um, budget-friendly nightstands on amazon we had found some at home but they were just like man like you need a nice stand grab that one real quick but the ones that are coming in today on amazon i am so freaking excited i found them myself because my man is usually the one that beats me to like the furniture the nice furniture the nice rugs that he finds on amazon and we usually order those like i think my vanity mirror he found it on amazon our um bed frame he found it like i kind of have the ideas and i tell him about it and he's just like does it and finds it but anyways these are the nightstands they're um out for delivery but like dude hurry up <laughs> i'm just kidding like i literally ordered them yesterday um yesterday guys i spent no joke all day in the couch the only time i got up from the couch was to use the restroom to take out coda to eat or to not even to eat i ate on the couch and stick shower let me show y'all and we're gonna put them me and you guys are gonna put them together they are so pretty this is the nightstand look how pretty it looks so like luxurious it's so freaking pretty and that's glass but yeah i'm excited to put that together with you guys damn while i'm talking my chest is starting to hurt like this sucks i was actually supposed to work today but i took the day off or they gave me the day off Ooh. but anywho i got a package from ysl beauty they have been sending me monthly packages and i am so beyond grateful i love ysl um i think i've only owned one thing from them with my own money because they are expensive so to know that i'm like on their pr list or whatever you want to call it is like amazing because they have amazing good smelling um products and i, I know like girlies go crazy for their lippies and everything like that but what they sent over was I, I opened it on instagram so make sure to follow me on instagram because i want to start posting like my little pr list on there and opening it with you guys on instagram but i'm also going to share it with you guys on here so I got this Libre um, YSL perfume or parfume is what they call it. Um, but look at this packaging. This packaging goes insane. I have another um, YSL but it, it smells totally different. This smells so freaking good. It smells like you're going on a date. But it smells so pretty and the packaging, I'm obsessed with it. I already sprayed some. And... It smells good. It kind of reminds me of like a little bit of men, um, men spray. Like my uncle, every time he would go, to, <laughs> every time he would go out, he would um wear this cologne, this strong cleansing cologne. It smells really good. So it has like a manly scent to it, but 
I don't know if it's like unisex or what but it just smells so good. I don't care if it's like man or unisex. I'm wearing this and I'm gonna smell good, okay? And the next thing they um, sent over is this roll. You know how they have like pronounced, pronounce it differently? This is the roll per couture um, in mousse. Look at this packaging. Shut up, this is so pretty. Look at this. It's like a dark, deep, rich again red and it has a little symbol in there how freaking gorgeous i love it and i might wear this tomorrow because i'm going to like a um lunch for my work and we're trying to incorporate red into our outfits and in memory for a co-worker that recently passed away and so I'm thinking like maybe I could wear like a white shirt and then have the red be like the pop of color. Now another thing that I got in the mail and I want to share with you guys I'm very excited about. Ugh, I spit. <laughs> um, if you guys are coming over from TikTok then you guys know what me and Zillow are like this. I've been partnering up with them for a little over a year now. Maybe even two. Um, but if you aren't from TikTok and you're like, who the heck is Zelo? What is Zelo? Zelo is a um, worldwide eye eyeglasses company, um, and I partner up with them. They always send cute, very affordable um, eyeglasses. I have a lot of eyeglasses. <laughs> Go check out all my videos on TikTok. But y'all, yeah, like I'm blind as a fat, right? So why not like wear cute glasses? to go with my outfits and to spunk up my personality i feel like you know what i mean like do you are y'all y'all catching my drift right now if you're wearing something like very if you look very accessorized like just imagine how that person's personality is you know what i mean so anywho they sent over some glasses um some of them i have picked on my by myself and some of them they pick um so like i get to get some i get to be surprised but i opened it but i have not my um i got anxious basically and impatient and i opened the box and i was like ah 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 ah, ah. we're gonna start a video today skylar so you have to wait so i kind of know what's in here but i have not seen it in person type of thing so let's take it out so i'm not gonna lie the vibe that i was going for when i was ordering these online was like a pink girl vibe um i love pink as you guys can tell i'm a girly girl um my camera case is pink i have like pink incorporated in my beauty room okay let's try these look i told y'all the first ones that were coming out were gonna be pink i knew it these remind me of um criminal minds i can't remember her name but i need to look up their names I don't know why i'm having a brain fart um but if you know who i'm talking about the girl that does all the research um and she always has like these crazy cute outfits like i these just remind me of her so freaking much let's see what's next another pink pair of glasses these the girlies ate up in green um on tiktok these are called rods i believe r-o-d-z I can't remember the name of these, but I will find out and put it on the screen. These are called Rods in Pink. And I knew when I got the green ones. Y'all see it? It's glittery on the side. I love these. And it looks yellow on the side, but that's just the that's just the film. Like it comes off. So <clears throat> but it's very, very thin and very like stuck on there. Anyways, I'll take that off later. But these are rods. Super simple, super cute. But when you turn to the side, like, it shows glitter on both sides. Oh. <laughs> oh. Baby. These right here. They have, like, that blush pink on the side. So freaking cute. I could... I'm going to wear these with this outfit. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Look at this so freaking cute Ooh, these i did not order i think they surprised me with these but look how freaking cute these are they're very unique glasses um and then you just put your prescription in you call up your 
or not test release calendar your what's the word called your something your eye doctor place wherever you go get your eyeglasses exam and you tell them to email you over your prescription you type in your prescription and that's it look at this i like these too i really like these i might do these instead look at these Ooh, these were everywhere like even on tv these are called brandon if i'm not mistaken now i don't think i'm gonna look great with them with my hair slicked back maybe with my hair pinned straight but we'll see you never know these these scream don't talk to me freaking cute oh, i love these i look at these don't tell me nothing these i was interested in bro like real bad these are kind of like a square look they kind of give me like those glasses back in the day oh i like these mm -hmm. what y'all think these are super cute you know i can't get the full effect because my lashes aren't on but even with my lashes off i like these so much these are the glasses that i just got in the mail not even like an hour ago i just knew i wanted to take a shower and like get ready before i try them on with you guys but i do have um i do have to go eat now so i'm gonna put this all together and then let's go eat. all right now we're in the kitchen i turned on the light because it was a little dark but let's take out the um, pasta salad because your girl is starving okay so i'm gonna try this poppy one of my favorite poppies is the dog pop um i haven't tried this soda if y'all don't know what poppy is it's like a prebiotic prebiotic soda for um a healthy gut and it literally says it like right on the packaging i really like poppy um the strawberry rose one <clears throat> the strawberry i turned on the heater because i was cold and your girl doesn't have a bra on but um i started i i've tried the cola one pretty good the dog pop is my fave strawberry rose pretty good now i'm a little skeptical to see how the orange is gonna taste so we're gonna have that and then this looks pretty gross but i promise it's really good so what i put in it is i put um cherry tomatoes or i don't know what y'all call those but the tomatoes cucumber onion green pepper poppy seeds um did i say cucumber already oh and italian dressing y'all see this this is like healthy like i'm trying to get in my healthy girl like you know habits again okay let me put this up and then let's get a straw for our poppy Mmm. With the cheese. Tastes so good. Okay, let's try the poppy. Okay, pray for me. Hopefully it's good. It's good. It's good. I get it again. It tastes like sunkissed, like the orange sunkissed soda, but with a little bit of vinegar. Vinegar? Apple cider vinegar? Is there a difference? But it's good. Orange is good. I don't have a lot of orange anything. Like I don't really gravitate towards like orange soda or anything, but I knew I wanted to try it. So whenever I go to Costco or like HEB Plus, that whoever has Poppy in a big pack, I know which ones I get, you know what I mean? I just chilled out on the couch. I ate my spaghetti. 
and I watched some YouTube and I was on my phone for a little while but I don't feel good amigas like like I'm cold I, I made myself a little cafecito okay I'm on Amazon right now and I'm looking at some stuff that I can get within a hundred hundred dollar budget on Amazon for Christmas um and I think I want a keyboard but while things were loading I was looking on TikTok for the freaking Red Bull drink that I was talking to you guys about y'all it looks so good but like I don't know how it's gonna sit in my stomach look let me show you that's cool I want to do that with my Red Bull whenever I show you guys and then look she puts creamer in there I think she puts heavy yeah oh extra cream whipped cream it looks good it looks like <coughs> a drink you get at Starbucks or something I mean not a Starbucks a freaking Sonic I need to get more syrups from like TJ Maxx and stuff so now whenever I go to TJ Maxx, I won't look for syrups just for my coffee. I'll look for like those crazy, crazy watermelon, blueberry, coconut syrups. And I see them all the time. That's the funny part is I see those syrups all the time. But I'm like, what would I make with this? You know, like I don't be making crazy drinky drinks like that. But let me show y'all the keyboard because the keyboard that I have right now babes it's it's time to go like i have this keyboard that it's like todo planado like you know like doesn't even work but the rest of the ones are fine it's just like it's está bellito. like i don't want it anymore you know it's one of my first keyboards and then it came with the mouse i mean i still use the mouse but i don't really want it i want something cuter so I found this one, has really good of reviews, 4.3 reviews for $40, comes with the mouse, beautiful colors, and I mean the mouse and the keyboard. Let me show you. Look how pretty. Tell me that doesn't look so pretty to you guys. Mira nomás. These are my favorite colors. It's definitely that time where I need to take my medicine and take this hair out of its chongo because I took off the braid but that didn't help nothing my head is pounding so I'm gonna take some um Dayquil fill it all the way up to the top these are the only shots that I take <laughs> yo my head is pounding I have to take a break from the computer I already picked all the things that I'm gonna get from Amazon I'll show you guys in a little bit but let's go take off this hair it was cute for a little while but now it's just time for the hair to just relax you know and then we're gonna make oh, i thought it was open and then we're gonna make a lip scrub because girl these lips yeah they need some scrubbing so let me get the ingredients look at it it's so freaking cute little baby Okay, so we got the vanilla extract, the honey, and the sugar. And then, like, I've seen some videos that they put, like, either coconut oil or just, like, oil, um, cooking oil. But we're going to just try it with these three ingredients and see what the consistency is, how it turns out. i also seen people put Vaseline in here. I don't have Vaseline. I have Aquaphor. I don't think there's a big difference. But I just want to see what this does you know what i mean This is the consistency of it. I think I did it perfect. For me eyeballing it, this is really good consistency. Mmm, I wanna eat this. This smells so good. Okay, let's put it on our lips. Mmm, I should've done this over the sink. Oh my God. 
Y'all, it's working. <gasps> Mm-hmm. Y'all, I can eat this. Yeah. I mean, this tastes so freaking good. Like, I'm not even trying to be fat ass right now. <laughs> but that's why they make those edible lip scrubs that you buy at the store. Any freaking who now i have all of this remaining where's the now i have all of this remaining so this is gonna go in my vanity so whenever i'm doing my makeup i can put this before i do my lips i might have just did something y'all make a lip scrub at home it tastes really good it feels really good now i do feel like my lips are soft but i feel like i need some hydration now so now i need to go put some aquaphor see i have aquaphor but i don't have vaseline but it's the same thing healing ointment y'all look crazy but it is what it is look what came in let's set up over here on the floor because i don't know i'm a little worried because the boxes look a little small but I'm gonna get the benefit of the doubt. I'm gonna get the benefit of the doubt. I'm gonna get the benefit of the doubt. Look how cozy it looks in here with the candle on. It's so pretty. So finally we have them put together. They did not take long at all, like at all. Max um, for the two, building the two is like 30 minutes. Um, very easy, very sturdy. So this one has an outlet. Um, it has two USB cords and I mean two USB um, outlets and then two regular outlets. <clears throat> right now I have the Stress Relief um, by Bath and Body Works burning. It smells really good, um, but we still need to get our lamps. I want to go to Marshall slash Home Goods to see if we can find some cute lamps um, before ordering some on Amazon. But I absolutely am obsessed with how this came out. Like it's not too big, it's not too bulky. Um, what we were really worried about was before ordering, making making sure that we got the right um, height. Because as you guys can see, we have a king bed. So we didn't want it super down low, but we also didn't want it super high. So I think this is like the perfect amount, especially for the price. Super cozy. It goes with our black blinds. So I can't wait to get the lamps. And then next, we're going to get a dresser a tv and i just really want some more home decor um because i don't have home decor to put on here which is fine like all i really need is a lamp my phone and like the, my books are down there my birth control is down there maybe my journal um and stuff like that No, she wants to give me kisses in the face. But good morning, amigas. It is now Tuesday. Um, I am sore for my body. And that's what I hate about like not being consistent in the gym. When you're not consistent, your body's like, whoa, what is this? And is sore for anything. This girl, she loves booty rubs. <laughs> I wish I could see her. Her body's like sore for anything. It's like relax like i didn't even do that much you know so you gotta like stick through the soreness from the from the first few workouts but it is i don't even know what time it is hold on 7 8 right on time i woke up like around 5 30 i woke up a little bit, bit before 5 30 but um i was on my phone checking emails and stuff so i woke i got out of bed at 5 30 
um and i just got ready i made myself a warm like lemon water with some honey because my throat is still not all there um but it's, it's feeling a little bit better now you ready to get down right, today is tuesday and i get out of work early today i still go in at eight <coughs> 8 8 30 um but we are having like a luncheon um i feel like all the leaders and manager not managers just leaders and um i guess like department managers at work so <clears throat> i'm gonna go and set up like later on but we are incorporating red um in the luncheon for like to show love and like in memory of a co-worker that passed away i think i told you guys that yesterday um her favorite color was red so everyone's gonna be wearing red and like incorporating red into their outfit um just because i don't own anything super red but i think red lipstick and a white shirt like will make the red pop <clears throat> so that's what i got on today and i decided to leave my hair down i wasn't sure if i wanted to do it like a slick bun or a slick ponytail but I think the, um, the occasion and the red lip like calls for a hair down type of thing. I don't know if I'm going to wear these glasses. I don't think so. I just grabbed them because they were right there and I couldn't see you guys. I couldn't see if I was like, you know, like looking okay on camera. But yeah, I'm going to go change and then we're going to make something for breakfast because I'm hungry. But before I do any of that, I need to take out Koda to use the restroom. <laughs> for sure because i'm wearing red lipstick but i don't know if i want to wear this like polo button up brown florin shirt i think this would look super cute and like professional or if i should wear this cozy like <coughs> sweater turtleneck i feel like i've worn this before and i want it to work for sure but i just i don't know which one i want to do i really don't know i'm gonna wear black pants these pants i mean they, all of my clothes has hair on it but um they're clean i mean they're in the same closet where coda's kennel is because she sleeps there but that's beside the point these are from target and i always wear these like i have two of them in the same color um, and I need to go get more actually to see if they have more in like different colors. I feel like I had more colors. I had like a blue one. Y'all hear my stomach? I'm I'm hungry. I really don't know which one I'm gonna wear. Because if I wear this one, I'm gonna have to find a jacket. I feel like I should be wearing this one. Okay, I clearly went with the polo. I freshened up my hair. My, why do I always curl my hair with like clean hair? Like I, I get the urge to curl my hair whenever I have clean hair. When I should be um, curling my hair with like dirty hair. But I think I do that because my hair gets oily quickly. So I'm like, I want to curl my hair while it's like clean and dry. But anywho, I curled it now um it looks good it's gonna fall a little bit which i'm not trying to mess with it because it's gonna fall on its own let me put my jewelry on because if not i'm gonna run behind and i'm right on time so i'm gonna wear my watch like always um my ring like always how it looks i think i want this hair to the back and then this one to the front 
super cute and professional. Now we just need fragrance and I'm gonna use the Libre um, fragrance that YSL sent me. So I'm gonna spray it all over so it can last. Look how cute this jacket is. It's so cozy because it's cold outside, no joke. And then I can just like tie it like this. So freaking cute. Now let's add more fragrance. <laughs> now I want to change out my purses to match like the red and go with the red vibe. So this is the purse. I love her. I'm ready to change out my purse because I always wear this purse like around like New Year's and Christmas. It just it just makes sense a red purse during the holidays duh um i was gifted this like a few christmases ago um from my grandma and it's in like pristine condition the only thing is i broke this and i've called before and they're just like bring it in i just don't do it i don't ever take it in so this little latch broke like it'll stay like this but look you know what i mean like it's just a wanga basically but i just gotta be very careful but it's still like in perfect condition so let's put all our stuff in here and then head out because i'm gonna be late all right i changed out my purse i'm gonna make a bowl of cereal because i am hungry and throw some bananas in there and then i need to take my vitamins especially the way with that especially with the way i've been feeling i need to take my vitamins you already know these I'll just make a coffee at work because we have a coffee station at work. So Cora banana. I always give her a little piece of banana. Here. Okay. I'm gonna finish eating my cereal, take my medicine, and then I'm gonna head out for the day. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Or not a little bit, like later on afterward hola amigos! it is now of course like later in the day i am all changed it's nighttime and your girl is headed to la cantera for my mom's birthday um we're gonna go try this whiskey what's it called it's called whiskey cake kitchen and bar i've never been there but okay i don't know how i look y'all my car has no tint for real my car has no tint so i don't know how i look if i look crazy or what or if it's too dark but i'm gonna talk and if not oh well if it looks too dark oh well but anywho um your girl is headed to la cantera right now i of course got out of work earlier i went to home goods um and honestly i was really upset at home goods like that's where majority of my time went and that's why i'm kind of rushing but not too much is because dude you have the whole store full there's no baskets and you're gonna tell me you only have two registers open that is insane that's insanity that's literally insane but my dumbass still sat in the line because i i'm gonna show you guys what i got when i get home but i found a um a 2024 planner and i had been i had been wanting one like the one i found for the longest and I just could never find it. So it's nothing like too extravagant. It's literally a planner that has um, dogs all over it. And it's just, it just makes me happy. So I got that planner. But y'all will never guess what I'm drinking. I'm drinking a, I stopped at the corner store because I had been wanting to for one, but for two, Oh, obviously I'm feeling better a little bit better than the other day that I was filming with you guys I'm pretty sure y'all guys can tell now But I had told you I've been wanting to try the Red Bull and the French vanilla creamer with the syrups and whatnot. Oh, I took off my nails Anywho um, So they had that at the gas station and I was like, okay, well I need to put gas anyways because I was on empty I was driving on empty and I cannot drive 30 minutes out on with my car being on empty, you know what I mean? So, I got off and I went to go check and they had everything there. The only thing is that I had to use the creamer that were in the little copitas. 
because their actual like creamer dispenser they were out but it's okay it tastes really good i did like three maybe two and a half pumps of <coughs> i did two maybe three and a half pumps of um raspberry syrup and it's really good i just got the regular regular um red bull and i really like it it's literally just a creamy red bull with a little bit of like i taste like more of a strawberry flavor than a raspberry flavor but they had they even had the little nugget ice in there really really good but i'm on my way there um and i'll see you guys when i get there I can't believe I'm still recording. I'm usually knocked out by now. I was looking at the previous footage of me in the car. Why was I so hyper? Because I was in a rush. I was drinking a Red Bull and I don't know. I was excited to eat. <laughs> Dinner was good. I'm glad that I got to spend some time with my family. But I wanted to show you guys what I got at Home Goods slash Marshalls. It's like a two in one. This is one of the things that I got. This was $9.99. My man said that this doesn't look like it should be in the kitchen. I kind of agree, but I kind of don't. Because our theme of the kitchen is the appliances are stainless steel and black. So doesn't this like make sense? Like I get it. I got to clean up here because like, like once again, like I clean up every other day or every day and it, it just ends up like chaos. I get it day-to-day -day life but goddamn if it's just me and him imagine like when kids are involved absolutely not anywho i thought this was cute um i just think it's more like aesthetically pleasing for one for two the bath and body works um hand soaps smell good i get it smells good but if you're trying to be like more financially smart i don't see myself buying a whole bunch of bath and body works soaps just for me to wash my hands like i might as well buy myself a big old gallon of soap and refill these around the house it just sounds more economically you know smart so y'all know christmas is around the corner basically damn near i got my godson this um blanket and this little guy for his crib it says um santa's helper it's super cute maybe when he gets out the shower and then i was heading out i should have asked for a freaking um discount because this is a little a little crooked but not me wanting to bargain with everything but look what they had such a perfect find i love it it's a 2024 weekly and monthly planner it has dogs on it i am freaking obsessed when i saw it oh best believe i snatched it up but before i end out um tuesday's video um and i go to sleep i want to show y'all what i got in the mail so i believe the brand is called you know what i don't want to butcher it let me get it the brand is called i do care Ooh, look at this this is the tea tree starter kit y'all see how they spell it i do care so they have the acne foaming cleanser the sheet mask and roll on face oil and the next product is these mini scoops mini ice cream flavored wash off mask set Ooh. so whenever we have like a self-care night or anything like that that i've been wanting to do with you guys for myself first and foremost um 
we can use these products now i have to put all of this stuff away but um before i do that i want to tell you guys good night and that i'll see you guys in the morning Right, let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm mmm mmm. That's good. I just know I'm gonna have to use the restroom later. You know that coffee is a natural natural laxative. These bagels are so good. Mm-hmm. Anywho, let's get in this morsels before everybody else does. So far I found these are super cute for $5.50. I think that's a good deal. These are really cute. hello you guys it is freaking 124 in the afternoon y'all my doctor's appointment was my optometrist uh, optometrist yeah well, that's for the eyes right optometrist i'm gonna be mad if i'm looking back at this footage and i sound dumb but my glasses eye glasses appointment was at nine why am i and my freaking my freaking watch just died it's 124. Why am I getting home at 1 30 in the afternoon? No business, but I'm excited to show you what I got. Um, first is Dollar Tree. Look at this cute bag, a dollar twenty-five. Baby, this was like five dollars. Something like this was like five dollars at Marshall's slash Home Goods. Um, super cute, it has glitter, it has a dog. So I'm thinking this is gonna be for my grandma. Super cute bag. Okay, and then <clears throat> I got these. These they have stuff like this at Home Goods, um, like what for five ninety nine each? No, baby, this was like a dollar something, a dollar fifty for each one. And I want to use this for my coffee bar, um, specifically for the hot cocoa bar that I'm gonna be making. So I bought some small um, candy canes to go in here, and then in here, I'm not sure what I want to put in here. Maybe some chocolate or marshmallows. I want to put some marshmallows in here. Um, and then some candy canes in here. So I didn't buy too much because I want to get a a gist of what I got going on here at first. Because one thing about Dollar Tree is you can't return it. Like, I mean, you could exchange it, but I don't want to buy too much. So that's what I got. Another bag from Dollar Tree. I got this little sign that I want to put hot cocoa bar um, on here and put it by the little um, Keurig station. That's going to be super cute. Here are the little mini candy canes. They had really good stuff. So it's kind of a hit and miss. Yeah, do not mind the mess back there. Like, this whole house is a mess and we're gonna get it together today. So not too much on me, okay? We all ran out the house this morning. But these little toys to put in my uh, big brother's stocking. So I'm making um, my big brother and his girlfriend a stocking and they have two pit bulls. So I just want to make them like um, both, I guess, a little stocking. Um, so I got them a little toy and then I, you'll see what I got them later on as well. I got this little Merry Christmas um, card from dollar tree very good quality card like this is so freaking cute this would cost like 5.99 at freaking walmart heb or marshall's or something like that so you gotta look you know what i mean you can't just my thing is like of course i like just like one stop um one shop stop or one stop shop type of, type of deal like i don't want to be going to all these stores you know what i mean now i'm wasting my time now i'm wasting my gas but like I think that is something that was worth it and it was right next door so perfect and then I got these little um, chalk markers for the little um, chalkboard that I got they didn't have red which sucks but green and white I think will do good I also got these little gift wrapping papers 
I mean gift tissue it has like snowflakes um white glitter and then silver because that's kind of the theme of the Christmas tree so it'll match and then some red to stick out it has like little glitter in it so I thought that was really really cute I also got this one it says baby it's cold outside super cute um these two little bags it has glitter on it super cute just for gifts you know the good stuff i mean that was a really good zeal right there but yeah i'm excited to show you guys babe look what i got look what i got so freaking cute i couldn't decide between this one but then i turned it around look it has like a mini hello key kitty right here this was $4.99. I don't know if I want to keep this one or if I want to gift this one, but I also like this one. This one, um, so the reason I got two is because I told you guys that my um, little brother and his girlfriend, like we have the same style. Like we quite literally have the same style. Like I love everything she wears. I love everything that she has and vice versa. You know what I mean? I just think we, I don't know, we like the same stuff. So. I know she's gonna like whichever one of these. These are super cute. They have bows on them um, with pearls and they're black. And so I could just wear it in my hair. Like if I were to wear this and I'm like all dressed up, I could just add it right here. Super cute. I, I feel like I would look really put together. So I got that. And then this is the stocking that I told you guys that I got my big brother and his girlfriend. Um, just so I can stuff it in here and then maybe I'll put like some gift wrapping out. Um, like on top of it to stick out so i'm not gonna put it together right now but y'all get the gist right to make it fat all of these balls for them i can't i want to give one to coda maybe i can give one to coda because there's three and they have two dogs so my baby deserves one but they squeak what is it mama you're giving it to your friends Huh? Bajate. <gasps> okay. Let's give it to her. Bajate de ahí. Bajate. Hey. I didn't even think. Like, I was going to put this whole bag in there for them. Please be careful. The reason I don't buy her these these kind of balls is because I don't want... Bajate. Is because I don't want her to choke on them. But, I mean, if I... You know, and um, looking at her while she's playing with it, I guess it'll be fine. Please be careful with this. Let me see. Is it too small? You like it? Bring it to me. Last bag. I got two mugs that I absolutely love. But look how cute i love it so this is the ramen bowl they also have a ramen bowl of this um of like these figures the same style but in the ramen bowl but i like this one um it would have been cool if they were matching but it's okay and they come with the chopsticks i found this one like uh, a couple months back um, tell me why I've only used it like a handful of times, but it's super cute. I don't want like my whole house filled with like Hello Kitty, nothing crazy like that. I just think these are just like cute girly things to have. That's what I got. And I think this is one of the last things that I got. This is a shirt. Uh, I'm getting this for a gift for a co-worker. Her, this is either going to be like a part of her birthday gift or, um, or her a birthday gift or Christmas gift. Um, if y'all follow me on Instagram, y'all know that I always post about her. We are always working together, so she'll like this. Um, it's a size small. Yeah. <clears throat> she'll like it, and I know this is something that she would wear. Plus, it was on sale. It was $10 instead of $17. So, really good find. But, yeah, these are all the things that I found very very successful um trip 
Hello you guys! It is now of course a few hours, like maybe like five hours later. I cleaned up the um, apartment a little while, uh, a little while ago, but I didn't complete it. Um, I wasn't, I wasn't prepared to come out to eat dinner, um, but my man texted me that we had reservations at Saltgrass, like very, like a, like a surprise basically so I hopped in the shower really quickly and then got dressed but I didn't do much of anything I'm surprised my hair hasn't gotten oily so I've been taking advantage and just been doing kind of the same hairstyle but a little different I even added the little um like bobby pin type of thing that I showed you guys that I got at Marshall's and then I'll show you guys my outfit later I'm really utilizing this coat um I love it my mom gifted it to me and yeah, I'm just wearing like very plain clothes underneath, comfy, but I'm really hungry. He's really hungry. So I just wanted to check in with you guys. Uh, I think I want either steak or salmon. I don't know if they have salmon there at Saltgrass. I think I've only had that place like once or twice, but it is 6.35 and it's so dark outside already. Does this light bother you, love? No, no, you're fine. <laughs> Um, so we'll see our reservations at 7 so we're actually not rushing at all surprisingly but yeah um, we never really go out on dates or go out to eat we were gonna get canes um, but we'll save that for tomorrow so I'll see you at the restaurant good morning happy thursday uh, my days are so off just because i was off on monday and i'm never really off on monday so my week has been flying by um thank goodness but happy thursday um we are on our way let me turn off this blinker because i know it could be annoying i'm obviously in this lane to turn but um happy thursday and i can't believe it's thursday already literally and then tomorrow i'm gonna end the vlog out for you guys um and i'm gonna put it like as a weekly vlog or a couple days in my life type of title but we are on our way to work of course but before we go to work we're gonna get dunking babes yep look i have a little thing that i showed y'all last night um that i got yesterday something about me is when i grab when i get something when i buy something i get obsessed over it um so i have to wear like new shoes i tell myself like oh i'm just gonna wear them here and there no babes i wear them every day until like the new balances i i told myself i was gonna take care of them really take care of them no they're i can't even wear them out because of how bad they look um just because i wore them so much but anywho yes we're gonna go get our duncan latte because why do i say it like that latte <laughs> um just because it was so freaking good and i reached like my max points like i have like 900 and something points on the app and yeah i'm gonna use it like they added this new exclusive drink type of thing where you can use your rewards to it yeah i'm gonna use it i'm for sure gonna use it and get it for free i kind of want some bagel minis again they were good i'm gonna ask him before i get it if it comes with two or three because babes the picture shows three like seriously but y'all do y'all like my hair or what i think today would be the last day oh in the school zone i do not like the place that i was living at before where i'm living at now i had to go to like two, i had to go through like three or two school zones and yeah i did not like that at all um it would mess up my routine you know what i mean but anywho um my hair i think this is the last day that it can last because it's getting a little oily in here but you can't really tell i use the um, l'oreal um dry shampoo and that smells so good by the way um and then i curled my hair and look i see it stays a little more than when i have super clean hair but let's get out of these school zones and let's go to duncan i'm very excited i was checking my points yesterday can i turn here yeah i gotta turn here because I missed my turn over there for being stupid. Well, actually for not paying attention. Hi, can I have a medium iced brown sugar cookie latte? Okay. And can I have the foam on top, please? Okay. With cookies as well? This is what the guy was talking about that they don't make it right like they don't make it the same every single time 
Dang it, hopefully it comes out good. She was confusing me, but I didn't want to like be ugly with her. I can't remember if you had the cookie butter and then the everything mini. Uh, yes, I had the latte. Oh, I think it's a little darker. It's a latte, so it's like, I don't know. I ordered it yesterday and they, they didn't make it like that. They made it different. Okay, thank you, mom. Yeah, that shit was dark. I was not gonna like it. Like, it was straight up cold brew with foam on top. Maybe she doesn't know how to make it. I should have took a picture of it yesterday. <laughs> thank you, mom. <laughs> you have a blessed day, okay? Thank you. It's freaking go. I feel so bad because she had to remake the whole drink, but it looks better now. I was gonna be on time, but it's okay. Things happen. It's not her fault. She was she was gonna let me go without paying. Damn. I, <laughs> she was really gonna let me go because she closed the window and like I stayed there of course because I'm not gonna leave without paying like that sucks like I don't know what kind of you know they take it out of their paycheck or what but um, she opened the window she, and she like put her head down like on her hand and she closed her eyes and she was like she, she looked like she wanted to cry and she was like oh, you still have to pay I'm so sorry I was like no you're fine and she gave me the drink and I was so happy. But I stopped recording because I was like, this is gonna take a while. Hello, you guys. Um, it is still the same day. It is just later in the day. Um, oh my God, it's been a freaking day. It's 7.09. I'm making myself a little bolillo sandwich um, because my grandma, whoa, this like, it's crooked up in here. Okay, I think that's better. Maybe I should put y'all over here. Okay, I think that's better. Hello, you guys. So, <clears throat> it is now 7.09. And it's still the same day, babes. It's still the same day. I'm making a mess. I'm about to make myself a bolillo sandwich. My, I went over to, it's been such a long day. Like, such a long day at work. Then I had to go pick up my prescription at another HEB. And then I, what did I do? And then I went... Um, to my family's home and picked up my packages by the way my brother freaking opened my Amazon packages so Sean if you're watching this I get to open one of your packages okay um so he opened my packages I mean he had good reasoning he didn't know like what was what so whatever um and then my grandma had bolillos if I grew up eating like breakfast bolillos oh my god breakfast bolillos were so bomb like with some egg some beans and some melted cheese like stop playing with me all right we're gonna eat together I hope this lighting doesn't bother you guys but we're gonna eat together while I show y'all and we open the Amazon gifts together y'all it's gonna be so good hopefully it's not too hot oh I am so hungry. All right. So y'all already saw the nails. I am so excited. Like, let me just, I'm not gonna put one on, but I just wanna see how it would look, you know, on my nail. I don't want it to be blurry. The shape of it, I wish I could show y'all. All right, let me see focus y'all see that it's gonna look so freaking pretty i feel like my thing lopsided oh well all right next is the freaking coffee shelves that i've been waiting for i love it so much but anyways look at this masterpiece y'all can barely see it because it's see-through but it's so cute i like it Mhm. Mm i think this is gonna go there we'll we'll figure it out in a little bit and then last but not least my baby i really hope it comes with batteries because i mean i'm not gonna use it right now one aa battery included okay well it better just require one aa battery triple a battery <clears throat> why was it saying aa like that i'm excited i have been eyeing this keyboard for such a long time it better not look like this like like this color that's not the one I ordered. It better not. Seriously. Uh, 
It does. What color did you want? This is not the color that I wanted. Look, it's so perfect. This is not the color that I wanted. I'm so upset. I mean, I guess I could deal with it. I love how the keyboard sound, especially with nails on. Stop playing with me. Not me typing my name from the numbers. This is so nice. I like this. I really do. Okay. I'm a, I think I'm going to keep it. This is the last thing. I hope this fits my MacBook because this is cute. This is the color that I really wanted. At first, I was like, where's the top? Okay, this, ah, oh, it comes with a little pink keyboard. Okay, let me go get my laptop so we can um, put it together. It better fit it, like, it's gonna fit it, yes. Look how pretty, I'm so excited. Okay. Mm, I'm gonna put it on. Let's see if it snaps on. This is nice. Oh, this look nice. I love it. Look, I think I want to have it right here. It looks a little messy over here. So, and then we'll have this little station here. Cute, cute, cute. I think that looks good. It looks really cute. So I just swapped this in the frother or the frother and the coffee maker i'm mean, not the coffee maker the damn coffee jar y'all know what i'm talking about um y'all let me know how y'all how y'all like it and if i should just switch the two or what's going on now that i'm looking at it i feel like the coffee should go over here because it's looking a little too plain over here you know what i mean i don't know but it's definitely staying over here in the little coffee area because I know you, I told you guys that it was either gonna go in the restroom with my perfumes I still need to get a shelf for my perfumes um but no this yeah it's staying I love it I'm glad I didn't get the $25 like two tier type of situation from um Marshall's because first it was expensive and then two I think it would look too bulky um I really like this like clear seamless little stair type of situation but yeah anywho um i hope you guys have an amazing day or night whenever y'all are watching this i am actually super tired i'm going to take off this face mask and i hope y'all enjoyed all of these days um i really try to get as much content out there um <clears throat> for you guys i had a lot of fun filming it and picking it up i've noticed that once i've done my first um week in my life that was really fun and then doing this one just picking up the the camera here and there throughout um my my week is really fun and more i guess realistic for me and my lifestyle right now but yeah i hope you guys enjoy these type of videos um if you do please like the video so i know that y'all do so we can put out more of these videos but yeah go ahead and subscribe and i'll see y'all next video bye